I'm actually about to go get some gas because I need it. I need it in the morning. Um, on my way to the office. Hi, okay guys, so I just got some gas. I'm heading into Kingston now, but I just got a call and I got another listing. This one is a house. So my first listing is a property, a piece of land in um, Hanover. So stay tuned for that. Or if you've already, uh, uh, if you've already seen that video, um, well, no, I don't know. This might go up before. This might go up after. But back to the story at point. I got another listing. Um, it's not in stone yet, but it basically is. I'm super excited and i know you shouldn't really get too excited about things because sometimes they fall apart but i don't want to be negative i'm just really happy and uh i'm so excited so i'm gonna i'm heading into the office like i said i'm gonna ask some questions about this to my broker i'm just so excited um it's wednesday it's 4 20 and i really wanted to do a video for 4 20 like an edibles video I'm considering like if I should still do it maybe I'll do it this Friday when I have no like real obligations to the week um because edibles tend to last in your system a bit longer than the other way but um I think look at places like Canada and there's actually a country before Canada that legalized marijuana medically medically legalized it um they have recreational as well I mean not the one in Europe I believe it's Sweden I think it's Sweden. Yeah. No, man, there's an ant in my car and it's enjoying me. It's really enjoying me. Um, but anyways, there's another country, uh, I believe in South America, that had already legalized it years ago. I'll find the name and pop it up on the screen because I did some research on it when I was um, doing a debate to legalize marijuana. And that is that, uh, for and against type debate it was really fun very informative and I learned a lot and I think Jamaica should really market you know Jamaica really should do more in the in the sense of legalizing especially for local farmers because countries like Canada even look at New York New York um, legalized medical marijuana I'm not too sure about recreational but I feel like we can so do better especially as a country that's known for for ganja you get me we're known for it i think we can do so much like it really boiled my blood okay it didn't boil my blood but it was really a wake-up call um i think it was miss universe or miss world i have a call up here back sorry about that my boyfriend just saw me driving and he's questioning me about which man in a gray shirt is sitting next to me. Okay, and guys, my bag isn't normally sitting on here. My bag was in the back seat, but I needed to pay for gas. And it, girl, I gotta go. I'm running a little bit late, so it's you know, I'm, my windows are locked, my doors are locked. But anyways, when I saw Miss Canada come out in full-blown marijuana um for like i can't remember what the category was or what the the um event was for that specific i think it was swimsuit i don't know something to talk about their culture or something and canada at that point had just legalized marijuana so i was like damn and then jamaica came out representing annie palmer this the um woman who killed a lot of her slaves for rosal and it's like whoa tone death like wow it was really sad so i really think i don't know i really think local farmers would benefit so much from it because people already have them you know them thing i hide up in the hills and whatever you know let's help get them licensed to do this even to provide to the places in jamaica jamaica does i believe some form of medical marijuana is legal in jamaica and some small sizes that people can carry but overall there's still such a negative stigma on it for something that really doesn't even hurt people and i'm not out here spewing anything i'm not trying to convince you to or not to smoke or ingest marijuana cannabis 
I'm not trying to convince you to do that or anything of the sort, but so far I haven't seen any research that says it has hurted anyone, you know? So, and if you want, I can drop down some links so you can't say I'm lying or I'm a chat too much or whatever. I'll drop down some reputable sources, um, some peer review sources that says it ain't hurt nobody, basically. So, I feel like our country can definitely, the economy, New York's economy is about to go, I mean, it's already up, but it's about to go up. You get me? Canada's, um, not Canada, California has been doing that, and I believe there is a state in mid, in the Midwest, um, that also has, has it going on that's really big. I'm not sure it's Arizona, I can't remember. Is Arizona in the Midwest? Um, or is just, is West? Anyways. I just think it would be so beneficial and it would be so good because we're already known for it. Bob Marley already paved the way, you get me? So at this point, I'm ranting, but I think it was well needed. Um... truck it's so cute literally I, this is what I'm like okay you might not hear me say oh I love this I love this but I do love the entrepreneurship in Jamaica I'm gonna turn off but this car in front of me is driving so slow so I can't even okay there we go I'm gonna go up so I can see if I can see more it's so cute I love I love this about our country I had to turn off so I had to like go but isn't that crazy like we make it happen we make it happen um yeah by the way I'm in Waterloo well this is Waterloo Square that's what they call this little area right there yeah I'm almost there just in case y'all haven't seen Jamaica's building up a lot. Like, they're building up a lot, a lot, a lot. I've never been to this lounge. It's, and I always see that, I guess it's a car wash, sports bar and lounge. I've never been here, but that's nice. I should come in here. Let's see. Cause my car definitely needs to be washed. We'll see how the day goes. Um. the things that they put up for stages man you know i miss going to a stage show i really miss it i miss the vibes just the vibes being around like-minded people who just want to have fun oh that's unchallenged hi guys so walking up to the office You see how bright the sun is? And it's not even 9 a.m. It's not even 9 a.m. Okay. I can't wait to share with you guys where I'm at. But I really want to do some photo shoots. I want to get, well, I want to get my information up on the website as soon as possible. Um, and if you do know what office is in this area, don't share it. I'm not ready to share it yet. And I really want to make it special. Um, yeah. I put mascara on. Feel myself. My earring, I don't know how many times I've talked about this already. But my earring, the one that I struggled so hard to get in that I had to go to the jeweler to put it on, came off. And I lost the back, so I'm so sad. But I have the jewelry. I have the front part. But I had to put on the old one, as you can see, 
and Chad, for the life of him, couldn't screw the ball on. So the ball isn't on, so it can honestly fall out, but that's beyond the point. But anyways, I'm about to be in the office. I will talk to you guys when I'm done. I'll just show you some behind the scenes. Peace out. So as you guys know, I'm in training. I, we're on a 10 minute break and I left my keys in, the, in my AirPods. I left my AirPods in the car. So I'm gonna run and get those. I would love to show you guys what I'm wearing. I'm just wearing this dress. It's really cute. And I'm wearing some brown heels. Let me turn the camera. This is what it looks like. These are so old, but they serve their purpose. So I'm just walking to the car. I got my notebook here. I've been taking a lot of notes. And I'm about to make a quick call. So I'm gonna jump off this video. I'm gonna make a quick call to one of my clients, ask her some questions, and then I will get back inside. <laughs> um, when I go on lunch, then I'll bring you guys with me to that. eventually because i know this is gonna go up before that i think at this point i'm not even sure but um i just want to say today was really good i went um to a viewing with my broker and some of the other new agents and it was really really fun it's really nice get to see how she interacts with the agents so up here amazing to be honest i am in the mood who is this coming right out behind me annoying why are you itch up behind me um anyways i'm in the mood for some something good so i'm gonna eat i'm i want tasties not tasties i want um i want what do i want i want popeyes so i'm gonna get popeyes because that's what i'm in the mood for I'm actually gonna call my friend and cut some out because I've been organizing. Oh my god, you people are so dangerous. I've been organizing a link up with him, not just for like social reasons, but for for um for business as well because we can refer people to one another. He's in that type of field where you know his people are gonna need real estate and my people are gonna need insurance so i'm trying to meet up with him um but he been acting funny for the longest time so i'm gonna give him a couple more tries because he's had it rough the past couple days but trust and believe anyways i think i'm going out of my scope so i'll be right back Alright guys, believe it or not, I've never had the chicken sandwich before. So I'm gonna just try the first bite here with you guys. This is what it's looking like. I never had the sandwich before. Like I was saying, even in America when it was going crazy between chicken sandwich from Popeyes and the chicken sandwich from Chick-fil-A, I never tried it. So This is what it's looking like. Let me turn it this way so you can see. Yep. Let's see what the hype is all about. The Jamaican version. Okay. It's not anything like special. 
I like the Zinger more, but it is really nice. It tastes good. It's a nice piece of chicken. It is a big piece of chicken, so. And the bun is really soft. I gotta go. It's still Monday, so we have the rest of the week to go. And yeah. Good morning, guys. So I just turned the AC on. I'm about to head on the road right now, and I was thinking that I would just vlog today again and add it with yesterday. So I have some more stuff to do. I have training as well and I have to meet up with another realtor. I uh, also have to turn in my REJ application form and, you know, do some things for the taxi. Plus, I might stop at Transport Authority today. Um, but anyways, I just have a lot to do today and I think it'd be a great day to bring you guys along. So good morning and welcome back to the vlog. I'm trying, actively working to open up the vlogs better but i also need to do the same thing when ending the vlogs and not ending them abruptly because i know yesterday i definitely ended it abruptly so please hold me accountable in the comments and today i'll try my best to end off the vlog with a goodbye so i'll see you guys for the rest of the day all right guys i had no chance to record inside because i was just on the road I went to Burt's and I went to Sean's and I got air filter, oil filter, engine oil for both the taxis and for one of them the transmission is getting serviced. The other one got serviced already. So I got transmission filter and CVT transmission fluid. So yeah, that's that on that. Um, now I'm heading to the mechanic. The car should be, the taxi should be on its way there because I ran into him on the road. Um, yeah. I'm going to show y'all what that looks like as soon as I reach the mechanic. transmission guy paid him left the driver with him and all the materials and everything and would you imagine that I'm almost to my location I get a call saying they gave us the wrong filter so I had to hurry myself over to where we needed to go over to the um the place because homeboy gave me the wrong filter so I have the receipt the driver have the wrong filter so i had to be like listen you have to meet me here um and we just work out a switch so that's exactly what we had to do now i'm finally at my location and i'm stressed out i'm just so hungry and my training starts i need to get inside hook up to the internet jump onto training order food and yeah so this is where i'm at today remember when i used to come to ac so often and I don't anymore. I don't anymore. I truly don't anymore. 
guys i'll see you when i'm on my way inside my foot is really hot so i'm gonna put my heels on because you know can they hurry up make them alive <laughs> It smells like tourists in here, aka bug spray. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't like pickles, so I took the pickles off. Matter of fact, I'm gonna eat this, but I don't like the way this is looking. I'm not gonna eat it. Um, fries, and it's truffled fries, I think. Um, so I'm so sorry, I completely forgot, but I was drinking water and I did drink some orange juice, so that's why I have two cups. But, um, I'm so upset, I forgot. I'm gonna show a video. I'll insert a video to this side of the screen of what it looked like. So, yeah. I wasn't meant to buy out today, but I'll definitely try to go home and cook. And if I don't, I'll try again tomorrow. It's only Wednesday. A little bathroom break. I need to go to the gym. Look, this is not. I blame it on the meal I just ate. But I do need to go to the gym because look like I'm losing. Ugh. Ugh. It's definitely the food I just ate because this wasn't going on this morning. But at least now I know what I'd look like if I was like one month. This is about, mm -mm. This is about two, two and a half months pregnant. This is what I'd look like. Interesting, right? Knock on wood. Cause sis, I ain't ready for no baby. Don't call it down on me. I gotta go, I'm too tired. I washed my hands, oh I forgot. Sorry about that. To all the men that watch my video, this is what the female bathroom look like. Now you gotta throw this away. to leave AC is getting hot right now there's like so much people here so I want to go home and probably film two videos tonight I was meant to film a video yesterday but I just didn't get around to it so I definitely want to try to film something tonight so I'm just kind of seeing what's going on and I have like two videos to edit so I'm waiting for some footage from the photographer so I'll probably have that vlog up going to get the listing on Sunday so hopefully maybe I'll have this up before that maybe I'll have it up after we'll see but yeah I'm just trying to find something to watch or something to get inspired by but well, Paul do you want to say bye to the vlog hey. tell them about yourself Speak up. Wait, ooh, one shot, one shot. Hello? Okay. Alright, guys, I'll catch you later. You guys are about to head home. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a great night. I always think it's so cool that they have an electric car charger, charging station. So, it's pretty modern. I really like that. I'm about to walk home. Well, no, I'm not about to walk home. I wouldn't reach home for now. <laughs> but I'm about to walk to the car. I'm going to turn the camera around. So the vlog is ending right here. I might throwing some driving B-roll. You know I love to do that. That's me. Um, just make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'm sorry if I didn't get to show you some things that I really wanted to show you. But I really do hope you like this video. Um, it's just, it is what it is. There is some things that I really didn't get to do, but I hope you don't mind. Um, I'll just try to do them in other vlogs and throw them in, like going to RAJ to 
put, turn in my application. Um, but yeah, I don't think there's really much other stuff that I missed, but I know I did miss quite a few. So hopefully I can get another real estate video out soon and some more sit down videos out, but 